Welcome, welcome to Monday Night Live with Donna G. Berry. And I am usually on on Saturdays with other, with a YouTube Live. I shouldn't say usually because I'm on a variety of times. As you see, I'm on right now. I just taught a, um, a lesson tonight on One Stroke Advantage uh, on the Donna G. Berry channel, YouTube channel. And I teach One Stroke Painting. I created this technique. It's fun, quick, and easy. You can take something with my technique and my stencils make a background real quick and look at the flower that you can paint. So I created um, this technique as I was raising my seven children. And I have to tell you, I have 32 grandbabies right now and soon to have two great grandbabies. And I love uh, sharing with you. I love teaching. I'm passionate about it. I'm excited to be on with you. And I hope that I get some new people out here that have never seen me paint one stroke before and know that you can paint something like this within like an hour of practicing. You can do, that's the same pedal over and over. I have tools and tricks to make it easy for you. And you can learn two different lessons a week, I add. So we have hundreds and hundreds of free lessons. And you can join my membership and be part of the One Stroke group. So I just want you to know something all about Donna, my website where you can get all the products for sale. Everything is right there that says about me. It'll show you my Facebook group. We have so much fun there. Lots of lives there also. My daughter and I both do them. Uh, did you even take a break? No, I didn't take a break. <laughs> I just want you to know, I want to do some filming really soon and put it a little short clip to share with you guys who join my membership. Um, people don't know, like if you like this, please go subscribe to the Donna Dewey channel and ring the bell so that when I pop up like this, you'll see a painting. I'm going to be painting with y'all. See, I've got my paint already. I'm going to be painting something really pretty. So don't go away. And so just click the bell so that you get ring ringed ring so it rigs you when I'm going to be up. Um, I also, hi from Brazil. Hello, hello. Uh, tell me where you guys are from as you're coming on. And so I, what I want to tell you, uh, oh, I'm going to go on and do a clip when I get back from, I'm going to North Carolina to teach all this week. So that's why I'm having to do this tonight because I'm taking off at daybreak in the morning um and i'm going to be there teaching all week and i'll try to come on and show some lives with that um hello Lori. hello hello uh, so what i want you to know is we have so many people that when they signed up it's like 9.99 a month or 9.95 i'm not sure so you go on and you can join and try it for a month you get four lessons and 20% coupon every month for everything on my website. So that's a pretty good deal. That's your advantage. So uh, so you can cover that $10 by purchasing something and get 20% off. So it's a really good deal for you. But I want you to know what's happening is that it automatically um, makes you rejoin every month unless you click the right button. So when you're checking in and checking it out, because some people push the right button and they never have to worry about it. You can get off any month, just cancel it. But if you want to stay on and not have to renew and go through that process, make sure that you check out how you sign up. Okay. So I'm going to pay today. Does that sound good? Hello, Robin I'm from Washington, right? All right. So real quick, let me show you. I create stencils and I want to just show you two stencils that I've done. All right. So this one is, um, you can see I did this. I did this on a shirt just like that, right on a black t-shirt. It does it so fast. All right. Am I backwards? I think I'm backwards. Um, let me flip the camera. Let's see if that works. All right. Hello. Hello. Catherine from Michigan. All right. Look, is that right? Yeah, there you go. All right, so I have to flip myself around a lot. So, all right, hello, hello. Uh, Ken, Kenny, how are you? So this is, for instance, you go, this is a Donna G. Berry stencil I created, and there I am. So let me show you one more. All these are on my website. Go check out all the different ones. And I don't use them like normal stencils. I use them for backgrounds and templates so you don't have to have, you don't have to draw a pattern. 
Uh, you love the rose? Well, thank you. Now, where is... Uh-oh. Oh, here it is. Now, I also... Butterflies are kind of tricky. Here, there's two different butterfly ones. Let me show you. All right. So, I did two stencils. One has... You have all the different sizes and side views of the same one. Dragonflies, different ones. And then this one's the other. There's all kinds of butterflies just like that. Only butterflies. And so, you stencil it on. It looks all gray on here and then you just fill in the segments with the right color so look how fun that is so what happens is both sides are the same the shape's the same and all you do is paint whatever colors you want on the inside and i teach you that so that's just a really quick stencil um deal i'm going to show you the brushes as i'm using the brushes but my tools that make everybody happy light lights out Let's see the internet bad here. I'm so sorry. You can come back and watch it um, later, Julie, when things are better, okay? Um, I watched the video the other day where you had to use two stencils for a B. No, it's one stencil. You put it on as two steps, two steps for the bubble bee, and it looks so real. All right, so my tools that everybody loves is a, you can get each one of these as a, as like a set that you could use, or you buy them secretly. I'm sorry, I'm confusing you. There's my brush basin, so it makes your brushes stay good. This is a palette. You can put a foam plate inside of this, um, and you pop the plate in there, or you pop the double loader in here. So it goes under, just like your foam plate, it goes under one, drops in. And, and the hardest thing with one stroke painting for people is loading. And this is your double loader. It's one of the best set things I sell right now because we can't keep them in. They're flying out. We've got a big shipment in, so they are in. But let me show you. This double loader is your magic tool. All right. And I used to use a solo cup. Now I have a good base in all these years that I created. So like this is the lid to that double loader. All right. So, oops. So here's the double loader. You put paints in there. I'm going to show you that. And there's a cap for the floating medium. A lot of people don't put the cap. <laughs> They'll leave it in there. Uh, it's my double loading tool. Yes. The double loader is great. Thank you. Uh, you guys are wonderful. Now I put the, I made a lid because I want you, like if when I'm not through here, I'm going to put a lid on here and I still have that paint to use it later. Um, so, and on top of that, you take and you wet this, dampen it, put this in here, close it up. Okay, so there's one, two, three, four, five pieces to this tool, okay? And then this pops back on. But listen, everything I'm showing you right now, you don't have to worry about it. You go to my, my channel to practice strokes new ones every friday go to the beginning if you don't know anything about one stroke and it shows you tools and floaty medium how to use everything it shows you every brush i use and what you do with every brush and how do you load every brush so go check out that's called practice strokes my most watched um youtube is practice strokes because you watch it they're tutorials shorter you watch them over and over okay snap that on it's ready to go but you can't have the lid on this when you put it in the double loader okay <coughs> excuse me oh, all right so ready to go all right i'm gonna paint now all right so go to onestore.com oh and the double loader too yes all right so this is the deal people are being confused when they <coughs> they go to get the palette which is a a, a loading palette I mean, this is a palette that holds a double loader in the foam plates and to stand up at your easel or painting on the wall or whatever. This is the double loader. All right. So when you're looking at this, people have gotten confused. And so I just want you to know the three pieces. OK. All right. And if you're a member, if you are a member on One Stroke Advantage, remember you get 20% off everything, no minimum. Okay. All right. So, ready. All right. Uh, I'm still learning to double load Donna's video. So awesome. Thank you. Thank you. You guys are very nice to me. So, y'all want to see painting? I know. No more selling. Let's do painting. <laughs> I'm selling you what you guys are asking for. That's why I've been on here. So I'm upside down. So I'm going to flip me over. 
And so y'all can see the painting good. And y'all just have to help me and tell me if I'm right-handed. I'm not, am I? I got to flip it. I, I, I saw it this time. There we go. Right-handed now. Thank you, Teresa. I wait sometimes a long time and you were on it, girl. <laughs> All right. Teresa from California. Hello. Hello, baby doll. All right. So here we go. Floaty medium. That's what we use instead of water. You could get this two ounce or eight ounce, but you're going to use it on all my painting with one stroke. Folk art, multi-surface is my love. All right. We have enamel paints and fabric paints, but you could do everything with these two. And these are satin. It looks satin when you paint with it. And when it dries, it's got a sealer inside of it. So you can go in glass, metal, ceramic, indoor, outdoor. Okay. So that's the beauty of that. All right. And so I'm going to start painting and I'm going to use for this free demo. That, I mean, the demo that I'm going to be painting, it is on art paper. So I just have a pad of gray art paper today that we're going to be using. And I'm going to use my brushes. Oh, real quick. Um, this is my signature brushes, 13 most used brushes with all my specialty brushes are in flowers, my roses. And this is the best one to start with. And that uh, you can't use craft brushes and do my painting technique that I'm sharing with you. It's called one stroke painting. So the 10 most used brushes, this is a great student pack and it's less than $20 and then you get 20% off. So think about that. This is more like $39.95 and then you get 20 off. All right. And um, the stitzels, this is the newest brushes I came out with, which is synthetic nylon um, stitzel brushes instead of these rough ones. These make perfect, no mistake, stenciling. It's a set of three. Okay. So go check those out and I'm on the way now. Okay. All right. So this is what I want to show you. I got some very pretty colors out here. I have two neon colors. So neon purple, neon pink. And so usually I don't put them together uh, and I put a neon a little bit later, but I'm going to kind of do both here. I dampen my brush. I lay it on the paper towel and I'm picking up these two colors. Uh, this is cobalt and dioxazine purple. And I can put a little bit of the neon, but it doesn't show well until you come back and add it. Okay. So I want you to see that I'm going to come here and wiggle, 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 and come down. All right. Now I can come back here. And add a little bit, but I'm going to do it really later. Oh, you can't even see that. Okay, so I want you to see. I'm going to grab a teeny bit of white. Now, look, I'm going to go in between the two colors. And then I come here and work it in. Okay, watch. I come here and work it in. I'm still in front of it. There we go. All right, so I'm going to come right here. And the dark purples in the middle. Jeez Louise, <laughs> it's not working for me. All right, so we're going to come right here. All right, and I'm going to come right over here. And the beauty of it is one stroke painting, you blend, shine, and shine. <laughs> Blend, shade, and highlight in each stroke. <laughs> hello, hello, guys. Thanks for coming on. Amani, hello. Uh, good to see you too, baby. All right. So now I'm going to pick up the neon. And what I want to do is pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. All right. And I'm just going to roll that at the end. So what I teach you is stroke by stroke so that you can come in here. Look, it's how you load the brush. Lots of paint. I come right here. I flatten it out. And then I'm going to come over here and wiggle, wiggle. Then I'm going to roll that up on the tip. Okay. Now that one doesn't show the purple as well. Okay. So I'm going to come back here. Okay. And we can, I'm going to see you soon, Imani. I'm going to be in North Carolina. I'm in Florida, guys, and we have a convention every year, and I'm right by the airport. Y'all can fly in. 
We can, uh, no matter what the temperature is, we're inside AC and we have tons of food and wonderful things It's at Embassy Suites. We have fashion shows with painting. We have all kinds of wonderful product there to sell and lots going on. Okay. So come, if you get, if you ever wanted to learn how to paint, come paint with us. You're going to love it. I teach you how to like give parties, painting parties. I teach you how to um, uh, create something that you can't believe that you know how to, that you'll know how to do. All right. Uh, yeah. You're looking forward to having fun. Me too. All right. So I'm going to rub that, wipe that off. And then what I want to do is I want to come in here and I'm going to get white and blue. Now they're not next to each other. So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to get this lighter blue look. Okay. So work it, work it, work it. All right. So I pick it up again, dip, dip, work it in. All right. So now I'm going to get medium. So I'm dipping it straight in the medium I poured in there. This is the fluff that's inside paint with no pigment, guys. All right. So hello, Miss Candy, you're back. <laughs> All right. So I want you to see how pretty that looks when you're when you're working it with it that way. I'm, I'm going to up here. I'm going to come here. And then I'm going to come on this side. And I'm going to roll the brush. Isn't that kind of fun? This side, I'm going to roll the brush in and back. All right. So I teach you how to do that a lot slower than I'm doing right now. But I just want you to see that right here, I want to come and I'm going to pick up blue. This is cobalt. All right. And I'm going to come right around here. And then I can come back up here. Okay, I'm going to put some yellow in here because Iris is um, what well, looks really good is a little bit of yellow in there. All right, so I'm just showing you a couple strokes that you can do to make your iris look really pretty. Now, I have these great brushes that are little rake brushes. I want to show you what happens here. I'm going to pick up white with this rake brushes, little, little straighted little strokes. Now, look what happens. I can grab this. And I'm just picking up straight paint on my rake, white, right on the wet. Okay. Isn't that pretty? Okay. Then I'm going to come in here with that yellow I just told you about. Uh, I do make it look easy, but that's my job. <laughs> I do want to want to help too, but I, um, if you ever come to Florida, you can come by my studio. We have fun. We have visitors today. A whole family came in, but you can also step by step. We have instructors that can teach you in your areas usually. And, uh, if you want to become a teacher, we teach you how to do that too. All right. So see, just put a little bit of yellow in there and I'm going to come right here. I don't usually use this brush for this. I'm just showing you really quick how to, on the chisel of a flat brush, this is my rake brush, right? But I just want to show you real quick. We're going to just put some white and yellow thick paint. Lots of people thought I was using oils when I started. I created this at my dining room table with those seven children I tell you about. Too much paint on my brush or not enough. Well, that's the, that's the magic of the double loader. What is the dark blue need if you for my new bedroom? What is the dark blue? Oh, it's not peacock. The dark blue is Prussian so, and purple. Okay, I've got dioxazine purple, dioxazine purple, cobalt. Okay, and the... Peacock blue is more a little bit different twang on it. Texas roses question. Donna, could you start offering large sizes in your multi? Uh, yeah, well, I have lots of large sizes, but plaid doesn't make the paint company. Does it make the two ounce? I mean, the eight ounce in every color, just the ones that sell the most in the retail store. So you can check on our site. We, it should have them. If not, write us and, 
uh, we can tell you which are the large ones that we have. Okay. Um, and then, so I want to show you, let's get some green. All right. And we are going to go back. Let's use a 16 flat. 16 flats, just one that's about $5 and it's not in either. Yeah, it is in the signature set, my big pro set. But you can get this and the green handle also, which is less money, just to let you know. All right. So I'm going to come right in here, grab that. I'm going to pull it down. Oops. They have a bigger stem. All right, so I'm going to come under here and we're going to go on both sides of this and then we pull down both sides of the bud and pull down and then we're going to bring those in here too. All right, and then we can also pick up some white and come around this way and pull in here. All right. So I just teach you quick and easy ways that you can make um, their steps to be able to stroke one stroke on top of another to get a one stroke lighted, shaded and highlighted. I have a double loader. I need to use it for practice. Go check out my my um, what do you call it? My practice strokes and look down for double loader practicing with a double loader and it will help you. I promise. OK. We put 100 people in a room that wanted to do one stroke. When we went in there, 80 of the 100 couldn't double load well. And by the time they walked out, it was flipped. It was 20 that still had a problem and 80 of them got it. So we knew it was going to be a success. OK, so I want you to see and it has been this double loader is magic. I created it just for all those who were trying to make it happen and it's not. All right. So then I'm going to push down, stand up and slide. Now I need floating medium when I do this stroke. So see, stand up, roll the brush and stand up. All right. And are you liking it? <laughs> Share with your friends. Tell them to come on and see what I'm doing. And come back and watch it and try it with me. If you already have some product that you can use, brushes and paint. This is the paint I use because it's thick and creamy and it's not in a tube, but it gives you that beauty of it. Okay. So I just want you to see quick and easy, but then I'm going to add one more thing before I finish today. And I think you're going to like this. Go watch this, rewatch this so you can see all that I shared with you for you to be able to do one stroke with me and feel successful. OK, so I am going to get my 16 again, maybe. No, I'm going to use a smaller brush. All right. So here is Juneberry. Yummy, yummy, yummy color. OK, so I'm going to come right here and I don't like that big stock. So I'm going to come in here. And this is a 12 flat. Okay, so that's kind of, that's bright, but it's kind of dull. All right, wet on wet, wet on wet. Uh, for those doing level two, yes, you're right. And is there delivery to Canada? Absolutely, we sell to Canada. We ship every day to Canada and all kinds of other countries where the paint company doesn't usually ship to, but we do. They actually send y'all to us. All right, so I want you to see. Uh, I'm going to put some purple and June berry. All right. Okay. Now I'm going to go right over wet and wet. Okay. Now watch this. I'm going to put the purple neon purple right here. Let's, let's put a little bit of purple. You got to put the neon afterwards. And when this dries, you won't believe this look with this neon. Remember, let it, um, it doesn't have to dry, but you put it on after you don't blend it. Okay. With the other colors. All right. So look, I can come right here and I can put purple, purple, the neon purple, and be sure to do multi-surface neon because the multi-surface will dry, um, 
I mean, it will also go in glass and everything and outdoors instead of the other neons that we have that aren't multi-surface. So that's just a little trick I can tell you. There's a few colors, about five colors I have to have at all times with neon. And I never thought I'd love it so much, but I love it. Okay, so this needs some brightness. So I'm going to take pink, bright pink. It's a neon gel filling. And I'm going to come in here. And I'm going to lay this on this Juneberry. All right, so we're going to try it this way. But I'm going to come back first. Let's take this. I want to try another way. I want Juneberry with white. And I want y'all to see that. Okay. So let's come in here. Let's add some white. Okay, now I, I teach you how to use a double loader right there on my practice strokes. So please subscribe and I'll teach you. I'm passionate about teaching you how to paint something you never thought you can paint. Flowers and most techniques are a harder thing to paint. Flowers and one stroke painting with Donna Dewberry is the easiest thing you'll paint. And then you'll, you'll grow from there. Okay, so see, I brought some of that lighter color. But what you need now is you need that pink neon in here. So it put some bright color on here. All right. So just the key is, is when this is all dry, just look at this neon. It will be so pretty. All right. Thanks for the hearts, guys. All right. If you ever want to learn how to paint, if you need an extra income, and you want to start teaching for me, for you, I teach you how to make money and save money by making your gifts, decorating your house, yourself, and more. So you can paint clothing and sell clothing. There's all kinds of wonderful things with one-stroke painting and more, okay? So go just to scan through the paintings I teach you. And people all over the world are doing one-stroke painting. And, um, and I created it. So how cool is that? I have traveled all over the world teaching in so many different countries. and never thought I'd leave Florida in my whole life. And here I am. All right. So this was just quick. I just wanted you to see um, that you can create something that quick. And I've been on uh, 30 minutes painting about... Um, 20 minutes okay so we can come in here and add some shading just think every little thing that you do makes it even better okay and i can teach you that so come learn how to paint we've got wonderful teachers all over actually all over the world Okay, and you too can paint with me. So come try it. Okay, I'll be practicing my irises. Okay, <laughs> well, I just did those really quick, but I wanted you to see. Uh, let's go back and finish this off with a green stem in the middle. Another green stem over there. We're wet on wet. And this is a ray, this is an angle brush. And I love going right into my paint because then what happens is that you have pretty pink in there. Look at that. All right. Are you having fun yet? Thank you so much for being on with me. I hope that I inspired you, that you want to try. Subscribe and ring the bell so you know every time I'm going to do a pop-up. All right. And I'm going to be traveling for a week to North Carolina teaching. And so we'll see you. See you later. All right. Thank you so much. And that might look messy, but it's quick and easy. <laughs> Come check it out on my site, on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much. And I'll see you next time.